Hello, and welcome to my channel, Planners by Christine. Today, I'm going to give you an in-depth walkthrough of my undated daily life planner, which is available on Etsy. And in the future, I'm going to have some tutorials to show you how you can create planners for yourself. So make sure and subscribe to my channel. All right, let's get started. This is the daily life planner. And this is an undated planner, which means you can use it year after year, but you will need to write in the dates. You can either write them in or you can use the stickers that come with your purchase and paste those in. And to do that, you come over here, copy. You can also add them as elements and back in the planner, paste those in and do that for the entire month. Now I've done that for August, so you can see what that looks like. Now each circle is tied to its own unique daily spread. So if we go to August 1st, again, you'll need to put in the date because again, this is, can be used year after year. And I've already added this as an element, so I can grab that. And these are the stickers that come with it so that you can have the correct or the matching font, which is called Lollipop. And as you see in the daily spread, there's a place to put appointments, check boxes for personal and work tasks, meal log, a place to track how much water you drink, your mood, and more things than that. Now back in the monthly spread, we can also access our weeks. So if I tap this, it brings up the first week. I already put the dates in with stickers, but this is what it looks like when you first open it. Now some people prefer a Monday start, so I've also included with your purchase what I call widgets. So this is the exact same spread as the default, only it's a Monday start. So you could copy that and paste it over top of the weekly spread. There's also some other options with Sunday and Monday starts. There's this look and this look, and this look, and this look. Again, with a Sunday and a Monday start. So you can do it how you'd like. And some people also prefer their monthly spread to be a Monday start. So you could copy out these headers and paste those over top of the headers in the monthly view. Now we have our self care section where you can write down habits you want to develop, mark off the days you've completed them, write down the number of steps you've taken. And in the sleep tracker, you can use the highlighter pen to put the time you went to bed and the time you got up and then you can compare throughout the month kind of what your sleep habits are. We have our meal planning where you can write down meal ideas and ingredients you need. And of course you can duplicate these pages, which you do under here and you go to duplicate. We have our finances tab. There's one for each month where you can write down your expenses, the budgeted amount, the actual amount and financial goals. Your reading journal to track what you've read. We have our projects tab where you can put information about projects you're doing. For example, we're thinking of building some outdoor furniture. So I wrote build outdoor furniture. I can write down the supplies that we need and the cost. I brought in some images to inspire me. We have our goals tab, daily, weekly, monthly, one year, three year, five year goals, a vision board where you can put whatever strikes your fancy. We have our dashboard where you can customize it however you'd like. Now, in my case, I put packing list. And so also these tabs up here, these eight tabs correspond to these eight fields. So if I tap on packing list, that corresponds to this one. So if I go, let me go back to dashboard and go to one and you see it brings up the same thing. And then on the second field, I put photos. And so I brought in a picture and you can do that and you can make copies of these white pages, the blank pages, and have as many as you want, but there are eight places where you can customize and create whatever you'd like. Now, one thing I wanna point out is how this planner is completely lag free. So I can go to different tabs, and as you see, it just goes from tab to tab to tab, and there's no lag at all. So if this looks like a planner you'd be interested in, you can purchase it on Etsy. There's a link down in the description and please make sure and subscribe to my channel so you'll know when there's other planners that I show you how to use on YouTube. I'm also going to have some tutorials to show you how you can create a planner for yourself. 